hello once again. It's me. Oops, nope. I'm back for more Majora's Mask. Okay, so this episode we are going to be taking on Great Bay. We can do that. But there are a couple boss key skips, like three, I think, for this dungeon. So, although one or one requires one bomb. One requires like um, say like six. One requires like almost all of the bomb bags, you, all the all almost all the bombs and sh shoes you can carry. So <coughs> the, fir the first the method that requires one bomb is extremely annoying and hard. The second method is easier. So, kind of a little harder, but not really. And the one that requires the most explosives. Rocking out. Oh yeah. Um, it's easy. You just don't want to do it. It looks so weird. I don't even know why. Okay. What's the new wave Bossa Nova? New wave Bossa Nova. Left, up, left. Right, down. Okay. Left, up, left, right, down. Right, left, right. What was it again? Left, up, left. Right, down. Left, right. Left, up, left, right. Down, left, right. Anyway, so just mash starts after this if you want to skip the cutscene. No, I missed it there. But yeah, you can skip this cutscene. I have mash there. You can also time it very well, but uh, I've never gotten it by timing. <laughs> I've gotten it, um, I'd say like 40% mashing so <laughs> overall not very good at it anyway so basically you know that turtle no, oh my god you know this giant rock it turned into a freaking turtle after we play a song link is so godly i swear link's so godly it's not even funny Anyway, skipping this would save time in speedrun, but it's kind of hard to do, so it's not really required, but it would save time if you did get it. Look at his mouth, is all like... What am I doing? Anyway. I don't even care what he has to say. Proud Zoro Warrior. Quickly climb onto my back. Well, we can't really do that. So, you know, there are trees there, right? And what can we do with trees? Let me think about this for. Oh, I don't know a second. Um, that's a good item. Bunny hood. I'll take out the bunny hood. Anyway, so here we go into the Great Bay Temple. A less annoying temple. Because it's, well, a water temple, first of all. Second of all, stray fairies are hard to find, and this temple usually takes me an hour. So, let's see if I can go more smoother this time. Well, when I click all stray fairies, it takes me an hour. And when I'm playing through normally, it takes me about five minutes. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Five minutes. Oh, <laughs> it's kind of funny. As in, the pirates try and go to, to the temple to get a bunch of treasure, <laughs> and then start flying up in the sky. Like, you see that is the Great Bay Temple. It is ridiculously huge, and this is gonna take a while. Here we are, the Great Bay Temple. This place annoys the crap out of me. So if I start screaming and pulling out my hair, and yelling and laughing like a maniac, just don't be surprised. I didn't even play inverted. Jeez, can't believe you didn't play inverted now. Cause we're gonna need it. <laughs> I tried to play this thing without inverted, and I failed miserably. Like literally the moon crashed and stuff, it was not cool. Anyway, so, 
Where did I get? I don't even know when I got arrows, but um, first of all, this first stray fairy is in this room. Um, we basically just have to light all these torches. The fire arrow slash dagger stick. Oh my god. Seriously? Oh my god. Your aiming sucks, dude. By the power vested in me. Whatever, dude. <coughs> Six minutes of fail. <laughs> but anyway, there's the first tier fairy. The reason double magic is um, recommended is because we use a lot of magic in this place. Like, just a lot. Crap ton, to be completely honest. What the? Okay, you really don't need that. I'd rather have the great fairy's mask. I don't really need the hook shot for a while, so I might as well get out the bow. <laughs> They're straight fairy again. I'm gonna get them. I usually get stuck here or get lost. So, prepare for fail. I'm not even joking when I say that. Prepare for immense. Oh, yeah, also. With nearly discovered bosses yet, this is the only room we have to enter in the temple. No joke. This is the only room we have to enter in the temple. That's why I say it takes me about five minutes. Sure, it might be hard, but after some practice, I finally get it. I don't know. You have to kill, kill yourself and get revived by a fairy. Pretty cool bossy skip. So I'll save a bunch of time rather than the regular one, which is done in this room. By regular, I mean older. <laughs> Basically, now we just have to um, turn on this. Okay, basically, in this um, temple, the mechanic is not a uh, switching. Um, um, the mechanic of this temple is not switching the water levels, it's turning on pumps and turning so you can reach different places in the temple. Kind of like switching the water levels, but not exactly in a new, better way. That was so ninja. There's another straight fairy in here, um, silver, there. <sighs> okay, so we got that done. The other boss keeps doing a hover. And clipping through the wall in here and stuff. That's a huge water wheel. What do you expect from me? Um, no, 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 no. Wrong. Huh, huh, huh. He's just barely made that. <laughs> there are quite a, I think there are like two or three straight fairies in this room. And one of them is actually in one of these crates over here. Well, this one. This crate, I should say. Get over here. Why are you circling around me? Thank you. Next Ray Fairy is kind of annoying to get, um, so you could get dive down there with Zora Linking. There's a pod that you have to smash and then try and get the thing, but the easier method just to shoot the pots if I can. Hold on. Do the Great Fairy's Math on, shoot the pots so that the fairy will come up to you rather than you coming up to it. Well, rather than you coming down to it. Where is it? Oh. Put up. Oh, only two. Anyway, so now. It's mechanical of this temple. Huge places. I'm not kidding. This place is huge. Okay. I do know how to do this legitly. I know how to do it glitchy. I'm gonna do it legitly for once. Except maybe for a hover here and there. Maybe some leg grabbing. Like you're usually, oh my god, you're usually not supposed to um, be able to get up here without using the hook shot, or you can just use a ledge grab, like that. Ledge grabs are useful. We can get many places we're not supposed to early, <laughs> especially in this place. 
it also used a little bit in um, the fourth dungeon. Not as much as it, I'd say in here. I don't think Glitch got. Like, it might, but I think this is. Yeah, it's too high. That's the way we came in, so we can't go back there, obviously. The water drain's too strong. So we go through here. Come at me, yo. I mean, bro. You know what I mean? Huh. Hey, I killed something. Did I kill everything? Oh, no, I guess not. God dang it, Zora. Oh my god, I swear. I thought Zora is the best form that you can be besides regular Link. I'm going to admit, Goron is kind of slow and useless. Deku just sucks overall. Now you're going to lie. Ha! Ah, Zora Punch! Whatever. <coughs> okay. Because while the Goron Mask is useless since it's skippable, Deku is skippable after Woodfall. Because you can just, you know, start bottle adventure. Well, there's no bottle adventure. Maybe there's bottle duplication, and then stuff about that. You catch hot spring water in it. But why am I talking about all this stuff? You know, over here, I believe, is our compass of the dungeon. I'm actually going to start collecting compasses and stuff now, since I tend to get lost in here. <laughs> I need to use you, and then it'll take me even longer, so I'm going to start collecting stuff and being smart, I guess. Also, the boss key's over there. Which we will get, um... What the heck was that? What? I don't wanna know. Okay. No. We don't use that language in here, sir. What language? The language of language. Duh. You're stupid. I'm gonna cut you. What am I talking about? I really need to think- Oh. This thing looks weird. Huh, <laughs> can't touch this sucker. Maybe you can, but you just didn't. Zora Boomerang, chop your head off. Although, well, you don't really have a head. You know what I mean. I'm gonna kill everything, like absolutely everything. Hey, no, I'm gonna open the chest. Oh yeah, also. What was I, what was I gonna say again? No, 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 It's not good. I don't want to do that. I have to travel all the way back through this place again to get back there because I didn't get everything I need. It's not going to take too long. But still, come on now. It's not cool. Not cool, man. Not cool. It's not, it's, it's not going to take that long, but still, I'm mad. Things start getting really bad in this dungeon later. <laughs> like, sometimes there's shortcuts. They become death cuts, and it's not cool, man. I have to kill all those things over again? Also, um, the most popular way to get this boss key early is to do a Zora long jump. Basically, Zora long jump, because, um, Goron and Deku will obviously be used to stay here, because they can't jump. And, um, the reason it's Zora is because Zora is tallest, so he j and he also jumps the this. So, that's the reason. I got a key! Um, you're actually running a B. No! Okay. Is there another chest in here? It doesn't seem like it. So now we can leave, I think. Yeah, we do. I just needed that boss key. Just for insurance. No, I'm not talking about insurance, Kyoku. Me. Whatever. Let's go down. Oh my god. Let's be a Zora skater. Ba dum ba dum ba ba dum ba ba dum ba dum ba ba dum ba ba na na. What am I doing? 
Oya. Ow. Crap. Dude. No, no. Hold on, man. 